The Duke of Sussex spent ten years in the army during which he served two front-line tours to Afghanistan. Footage of the current turmoil shows desperate Afghans trying to flee the country via the capital city's airport. Prince Harry, who also created the Invictus Games Foundation for wounded servicemen and women after his time in the military, spoke out on the crisis in a joint statement with senior figures from the organization. The statement, shared on the foundation's Twitter account, highlighted the importance of members in the military community coming together. It read, What's happening in Afghanistan resonates across the international Invictus community. Many of the participating nations and competitors in the Invictus Games family are bound by a shared experience of serving in Afghanistan over the past two decades, and for several years, we have competed alongside Invictus Games Team Afghanistan. We encourage everybody across the Invictus network, and the wider military community, to reach out to each other and offer support for one another. Prince Harry is set to return to the UK at the end of the year to prepare next year's Invictus Games in Holland. The Duke will spend a weekend in Nottinghamshire and will also visit the Queen before returning to California. A source told the Sunday Express, the Duke of Sussex will want to make sure we are ready as the last games were cancelled because of Covid. They added, we are hoping that the situation in April next year allows the games to go ahead as planned, in Holland. Our understanding is that the Duke of Sussex will be accompanied by a small film crew in order to allow the public to see the hard work involved in planning these games. Last year Prince Harry announced the cancellation of the Games 2020 edition due to the coronavirus pandemic. In a video shared on Twitter, he said, I know how disappointed you all must be. This is a focus that so many of you need. You can use this opportunity to get even fitter and be at your absolute top mental and physical fitness. Please take care of yourselves, but do what you do best which is reaching out to other people, be it those that still wear the uniform, used to wear the uniform or just those people in your community who you know may be suffering or may be vulnerable during this period. Thank <laughs> you.